Hi Scorpio and welcome back. This is your New Moon and Gemini journal reading. I figured rather than do a whole separate video on the Gemini and New Moon, I'd just integrate it and see what sort of energies are coming up in the daily journal. I'm going to pull three cards from the Rider Waite. That is one. And then I'm just going to pull the same old Lenormand and Marsha McLuhan Distant Early Warning deck. Alright, that's two. Let's see what else we have for Scorpio for the New Moon in Gemini. There we go. All right. So, Scorpio, we have the Empress, the Ace of Wands, and the King of Pentacles. Wow. <laughs> awesome. Looks like this New Moon's going to be just fine for you. Um... You may find uh, a new passionate partner or a renewed sense of passion for your current partner. So this is definitely, um, you know, uh, a power couple. <laughs> you know, the, the Empress and the King of Pentacles. It's, we're talking serious abundance right there. And then, of course, the Ace of Wands represents passion. Period. So, you know, you could be also involved in a passion project with a Taurus, um, you know, uh, or a Libra, or any earth sign, really. So you've got, because the King of Pentacles represents earth, so that's fertile Taurus Capricorn. Um, so, awesome. That's excellent. So let's see what the Lenormand has for you. Wow. Happy New Moon. Scorpio. Okay, so the Lenormand. Oh, see, and then this is where Nep Neptune kicks in. Um, Neptune, confusion, not really sure, don't have all the information. It's foggy. I can't see clearly. That's what these energies are. So, you know, um, whether or not this passion that you're feeling can be sustained, I would... I would, you know, be careful with your expectations when when Neptune is in the picture. So, uh, and as I mentioned in the Venus retrograde video uh, that I put up uh, last week, um, you know, Neptune is kind of causing these these areas where you know it's like we're really challenged by: is this good for me, or is this just wishful thinking? So make sure you keep that in mind as you proceed through the next few weeks, especially. All right, so what does Marshall have to say for you? There it is. Anthropology is the study of man embracing woman. Well, that's lovely. And that's the three of hearts, which is the three of cups. So, you know, there may also be a reunion on the horizon for you. Um, with someone who is solid and, um, you know, who, who actually, you know, has a lot of respect for you. So, um, and that actually may be where your confusion is. So, um, be careful of, again, energies of wishful thinking or of old patterns of thinking that were obstacles for you in the past. All right, Scorpio. So I hope you found this helpful, and we'll see you again.